Okay, so we're back. Uh, we were able to get irrigation first, and of course, that's the bonus that we were looking for, which is uh, plus one population for your cities. Okay, so now we're gonna probably go for for writing. Take a look. Um, let's see which path we're gonna take now. Um, yeah, probably we might need to go with uh, probably Call of Law is one of the next objectives, so uh, we can start looking for more expansion. So okay, so we're going for grading. Um, okay, uh, it's a classic deity. AI, they get very aggressive, so we're gonna try to be more careful with the Spaniel for now on, okay? So we're gonna try to find, yeah, probably that's a good chalk point, so we can keep those guys in that area. Uh, it's good to have a, a veteran warrior group in there, so we can probably put a stop before it's too late. So now we're going for the library. <coughs> We're gonna adjust a little bit more the our workers, so we should be able to get a library sooner. Okay, so we're gonna sacrifice one science in order to get two more hammers. Um, we're still trying to get Confucius. Hopefully, we're gonna be able to to get it before anybody else. Uh, I'm pretty sure that it's gonna be the case. Uh, let's see what do we have. That would be nice to get some something very interesting <coughs> so we got a great explorer and we got a great humanitarian so mm, actually that works pretty good for us if we think about it we can probably use the, the explorer to get the hundred gold and get our settler and after that we can use the humanitarian to to do plus one in both cities okay so it's important to know exactly when which is a good moment to to use your great persons okay sometimes it's not that straightforward sometimes you need to wait for that that specific moment that can give you the the edge so i'm not gonna rush anything right now because i'm trying to save the goal for our settler and um, of course, uh, there is. We need to still try to figure out what is the rest of the guys. Uh, okay, we got a free spy because of the 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 writing, and now we gotta move forward to our yeah, probably bronze working will be fine, especially because we need some kind of defense in our in our city. Okay, so right now we're gonna. Add um yeah we're, pr we're gonna probably gonna add the hundred gold to our treasure, and then after that we can start getting get an advantage and move that settler and get a another city and move a little more faster. Okay. Exactly. So in the next turn we should get our free uh, settler which is fine right? right now we're not going to use the great humanitarian we're just going to leave in there for one more turn uh, a couple more turns actually and then we're going to find a good location for the our next uh, uh, city okay so yeah we got our free settler and uh, uh, the roman of course wants to take it right away they they, <laughs> they actually get very very excited every time that you get a great person so get ready to if you save it for one more, more than one turn get ready to to start getting some complaints for those dudes um, or I keep gotta find a probably a quiet island uh, which can give us an edge for the dye and the whales and fishes to make it grow faster right now we can use the gold uh, we already got the hundred so we're gonna rush the library and we go for the granary because well as we know it was a little risky taking that location uh we don't we don't have much food around okay so our next um our next uh, technology 
and we're gonna try to take advantage of the bonuses if we reach it first. Mathematics could be interesting, but that one is much better because if we reach it first, we got one extra science per city. So right now we're gonna be a little more careful. Our first city, the location is not bad, but it's not the best. So we might probably wait a little more and find a good location for our second city. Um, we're not gonna use the humanitarian yet. We're gonna wait a little more. Um, probably, yeah, move a little more. Yeah, we got some well fish. Ah, two fours, not bad. And we have die. Yeah, probably this is gonna be our uh, perfect location for for our second city. Yeah, it's not gonna have much production, but uh, we're gonna be able to have a city who's gonna grow very, very fast. Right? Oh. And we have some extra 12, 20 gold for the for that landmark. Okay, so we're gonna start setting this city right away to just grow and uh, get the science as soon as possible. Uh, get some archers, of course. It's very important to protect your expansions right away. So we're not going to get too excited and, and just rush in science and all the stuff. Uh, especially if you play multiplayer, you need to be uh, careful, of course. And now we can probably use our great humanitarian. And we're, we're going to add one population to both cities. So, yeah, we were were a little more patient and uh, the Roman get peace trying to get the great person but for us works pretty good so now we have a uh, deli in six and the other one should be on four which is uh, we got probably yeah actually got the second position in the in the ranking of cities uh, for now well we're just gonna leave this spaniel to make some noise that's fine as long as we keep some units protecting our base, uh, our main city, and uh, our expansion, we should be fine. Um, yeah, we're gonna, yeah, archers is gonna be our main main construction for now in the in Mandras. Um Yeah, our warriors are doing a pretty good job with fortification in there, so at least we should be able to hold the Spaniel. Okay, so now. Um exactly. Let's go for that one first. And then we're gonna take the call of law. And yeah, that one the bubble towers a little too far, so I don't I don't think it's gonna really work. So we might need to probably wait. Got our first army of archers and after that we should be fine. And uh, we're going back to our granary because we need it in a hurry. Uh, right now the spaniel is blocking our only food resource, so it's very important to move fast. Don't 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 let it get fortificated on anything. Well, in this case I leave it too late, but uh, we always can do something extra. All right. Oh, we got the German, which is another frisky enemy. Uh, we'll see what happens. Okay. Um, Let's not rush anything for now. We don't really have much gold, so we can probably save it in case an emergency. Okay, so we have our first catapult. That was the whole idea to get mathematical spares. And that was another big bonus. You got a, a very strong unit uh, that we can use in defense in Delhi. So we can try to get rid of these guys before they get fortified. And so it is very important to find a way to to be more flexible in in your game. It's not that straightforward, and you gotta adjust a little bit. So instead of call of law, we decide to move to mm, mathematical, so we can get some those catapults up and running. Okay, so with that, yeah, we should be able to kill the these guys, and we can also start building our first army of catapults which is this probably give us an edge uh, at the beginning of the game. And yeah, it's gonna be tough to get there, so I don't think we're gonna be able to do it. But let's see what happened in the next video, okay?